Hi everyone! In this video I'm going to talk about the front end editor of Visual Composer. You can access it when editing or creating any page or post with Visual Composer. So, this is the front end editor. The first thing you see is the navigation bar here on the left and your content on the right. Just how it looks on the published site. It contains the tools you'll need to create your page. First in the navigation bar is the Add Content window, which opens the Element, Template and Block Library. Then there's 3View, where you can see and manage all the content that you have on your page. Undo and redo buttons right here. Next, there's the bell icon with Visual Composer Insights and Notifications. Insights is a built-in content analysis tool. You can get more info about that if you click on the link in the corner. There's going to be a video about that. In the other tab, you'll see notifications about Visual Composer, like a new update, announcements about upcoming discounts and more information you might find useful when building a site. Other handy option is the responsive view, which allows changing the view of your page to fit multiple devices like mobile or tablet and here is the Visual Composer Hub, where you can find extra content elements, templates, blocks, add-ons, stock images, and GIFs. This is where you'll see the global on-page settings. You can click on the section you want to adjust, like page layouts. Here you'll see the title, set a featured image, and more options. Here, you'll also find the global design options that allow adjusting the margin border padding for the whole page, as well as set a background color or image. You can save your page here. One of the best assets of Visual Composer is that it's a what you see is what you get editor. So the layout you've created here in the front end editor is exactly what will be visible live. The only difference is that when you hover over the content in the editor, you'll be able to edit it. You can change the images, add text and much more. These are the element controls and you'll see them for every single element. Again, to learn more, click on the link and you'll see a video explaining exactly what they are. And that's it for this video. Thank you all for watching and enjoy.